Hi there folks, Kevin Carroll here with your PM update taking a look at just a few of the things we've got planned for you in Thursday's edition of the Times Leader. Our coverage of the 50th anniversary of the Agnes Flood continues. Tomorrow I'll have a look at how improvements to the region's Susquehanna River levee system have increased protection in some areas but not all. We'll also tell you the story of how staff writer Bill O'Boyle and his father were affected when the flood waters hit Plymouth. And remember, be sure to pick up the Sunday paper to check out our special section devoted to the 50th anniversary, including more stories from local survivors. In other news, Ed Lewis was in court as a criminal trial began for Willard Bidding, who was accused of intentionally striking a man with a vehicle in Plymouth. And in the Times Leader Test Kitchen, Mary Therese Beeble will have a simple summer recipe for tomato stuffed with cream cheese and bacon. As always, folks, we thank you for reading, and if you're not already a Times Leader subscriber, all you have to do is call 829-5000 or go on over to timesleader.com slash subscribe. That's all for now, folks. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day.